Sebastian Castro here with Castro Drums and today I'm talking about going simple. I did a video a while back about being a creative drummer and this was the idea behind it. Basically what I was talking about was actually using a cajon as a kick, I'm using uh, my snare, it's a Birch Concept uh, PDP snare. I'm also using Sabian SR2s as my hi-hats and then I'm using a small splash. Got the splash connected straight to the hi-hats. That way when I take them out of the bag, they're all pretty much separated and I'm able to take a smaller bag instead of having to take a bigger uh, a bag. And, and of course one of the things that I was talking about the last time was I've been playing as an acoustic show and on this video you can actually see that I am using uh, the cajon, I'm using a snare, hi-hats, I'm also using a shaker and a tambourine. I'm trying to change it up a little bit more. That way it gives it more of that acoustic feel. You know, to be honest, it's really worked out a lot. Um, just using this setup here, being able to, you know, rig something up for the cajon. Um, and then just later, I was actually thinking about adding another clamp and running it off the hi-hats. That way I, I can actually just take the, the snare and just use uh, the snare top, which is this right here take it off and take it that way if I decided to. Now of course I've seen, um, I believe my nail sells a small little uh, like a snare and, and I saw that and I was like man that's, that's a perfect idea but I don't do enough of that to actually go out and buy one and I actually have two different snares so I'd rather take my snare, take my hi-hats, take a splash and just keep it that simple. And what I want to do is actually show you guys how to just get creative behind it just wanted to share this quick tip of staying creative and just using something simple. If you're doing an acoustic setup, I would suggest maybe something like this. I'm, we'll, we'll use my shaker, my tambourine. Um, if there's anything else that will help you stay creative, then you know you can get whatever you need that would help you. There's another video that I talk about different sticks. Of course, in an acoustic show. You're going to have to play really low when it comes to something like this. So check out that video that talks about different sticks. Uh, one of the sticks that I that I have, these are actually the Bader Cajon brush. And um, they're a lot thicker than the other brushes that I use, which are the Bader whips. And I'll show you guys a sample of what that sounds like. So these are the Cajon brushes. Uh, these here are the Vader whips. They're used more for the drum set to kind of bring the tone down. But I'll show you what it sounds like here with this. It's still going to give you the same idea. Still same concept. Drum hasn't changed. But at least that way you have an idea what you're working with. Uh, and what I like on these is to kind of doesn't doesn't give you a loud sound but if your acoustic setup is a lot more lower than expected these are a good way to go so give you something a little bit more different uh, for me I would definitely even just use shaker
tambourine. So just gives you different ideas of what to work with. Today's quick tip is just a little bit of an idea of how to change your setup and go if you have a friend that's playing an acoustic setup and actually you don't want to go out there and play on your cajon, then you can actually set up something a little bit more smaller that you'll be able to go out and still jam out with. You won't have the full toms, you won't have the full setup. Now I have two bongos and to be honest, just the idea of it, just to throw an idea, I wouldn't mind even throwing a clamp from the bottom and putting it on another arm and having the two bongos here. Maybe you can use them as toms or something, but it would still keep you as an acoustic feel, an acoustic environment. That's today's quick tip, guys. I really didn't want to spend too much time on this video, but definitely wanted to share something with you guys this Thursday. And I got some products that are going to be coming in very excited to be talking about it uh, it's actually a very big blessing won't be sharing too much of it yet you guys have to stay connected to know what I'm talking about hey guys if you like this video subscribe hit that like button and if you want to get notified of some more videos that I'm gonna be posting hit that bell so you guys will be notified other than that you guys have a blessed day God bless guys here we go